salut tout le monde, on se retrouve aujourd'hui pour la suite du let's play de The Witcher 3 La dernière fois nous nous étions arrêtés juste avant, euh, à la fin de, de quelques quêtes annexes On va tout de suite continuer en allant rendre visite au chaman Donc j'espère que, euh, que vous allez bien plutôt La vidéo qui commence il fait direct Je veux parler avec le chat avec Un What do you want from him? To give him what he deserves. And that is? He done conjured Algaris, said something evil had made its nest in Edric's bowels, told Edric to eat rowan berries, lots of them. Ever since Edric's lived in the outhouse, and he's got hardened postures all over him. Just so happens I need the Peller alive, so if you agree to leave him alone, for good, I'm willing to tell you how to help Edric. Hmm, well, all in all, yes or no? Fine. Let's hear it. A tea of mullein leaves for his belly, and cover his boils with mallow. A few days and he'll be good as new. Noted. But if it don't work, we'll be back. Move out, boys. Et voilà. Euh, attendez. Me revoici, désolé pour cette petite ellipse. On continue. Hey, anybody home? Open up, it's safe now. Attendez. Voilà, c'est mieux. What seek you? I need your help. Oh, a man, nay, a wolf, grey, though not old. Tis he the pillar awaits. Expecting me. Aye, as the bones declared I should. They shall come who stench is rape and death, but the wolf shall disperse them, the white wolf. And thus he comes. Omens never lie. Recognize this. Made of spruce wood, strong smell of juniper, designed to protect someone. Freshly cut spruce, sprinkled with goat's blood, then tempered with an incense of earth, smoke and juniper. For Anna, to protect her. You make the amulet? Aye, sure it was the Pella. After the way of his forefathers, over still water in the light of a full moon. Proper as amulets go. It protected well. Should never have taken it off. So, designed to protect her. From what? Oh, the dear. Besieged she was, evil all around, wanting to possess her. Old magic, born of oblivion, from dark sources emerged. Old magic? Can you be more specific? It is not for mouth speech, nor for the touch. A small protective charm, not a thing more a Pella could do. Anna and her daughter are missing. Know where they are? Nay. No, nay, Pella don't know. But the spirits could know. The Pella will augur, the spirits ask. Spirits, great. Fine with me. As long as I know where to look, where to find them. Lost, lost, must be found. Princess! None better than princess for finding things. Princess? Which princess? Princess, my goat! She's fled. Sorry. Those men must have scared her off. Can we get back to the auguring? Without the goat, impossible. No goat <laughs> won't work. <sighs> Will you help me if I bring the goat back? Princess, princess, where have you got to, girl? Fine, I'll get your goat. The bell, the little bell's ringing. She loves it. Ring, ring, and she will follow. But for a while. But beware of wild strawberries. Raspberries, too. Yeah, treacherous as beasts go. I always keep an eye out for them. Attendez, avant. D'accord. 
j'ai pas le choix. Ah là là. Qui sont idiots parfois hein This way, I think. Suivons les pas. Ah, elle est en train de se faire manger, je parie. Laissez-moi deviner. Ah, je l'ai vu. Je l'ai entendu surtout. What Ah, ils me font très peu de dégâts, d'accord. Elle est où Ah oui, il faut que j'équipe, ah, c'est vrai. Alors, inventaire. Donc j'ai changé encore d'équipement un peu. J'ai un équipement plus fort maintenant avec euh, l'armure du griffon améliorée partout. Et ainsi qu'une nouvelle euh, arme, une main. Et je suis niveau 16, bientôt niveau 17. Euh, où est-elle cette euh, fichue Où est-elle cette fichue cloche Clochette, où es-tu Elle est déjà équipée, d'accord. Là voilà. There you are. Oh, ça va être chiant. Allez viens Where the hell do you go Qu'est-ce que tu fous Ah uh... Bear Bear Run you stupid piece of shit Voilà I really have to keep ringing this bell for you to follow. Allez, viens. Suis-moi, petite. Attendez, comment ça, un lieu spécial ici Ah oh non, c'est juste là pour rendre la quête. Oh, tu, tu vas pas. Euh... En cesse. Allez. Dis bonjour à ton maître. Voilà. Goat of mine! Dearest, sweetest goat. <laughs> Happy for you, but I'm kind of in a hurry. Anna and Tamara, you might be in danger. The white wolf helped the Pella, and so the Pella shall help him. Blood. We need blood. A living being. Fine. Be right back.
flesh and blood. Who's? No one. No tomorrow. Just a child. Ok, j'ai compris. Enfin, je pense avoir compris de quelle enfant il parle. Ah non, <rire> c'est pas celui là que je pensais. It's over. Is that it? That is it. Spirits had nothing more to say, like where they went or where they are now. You came for an augury, an augur I did. They're gone. The child remains. You mentioned a child. Whose? Why, Anna's. Anna was pregnant. She was. And she miscarried. Hmm. Baron didn't mention it. Afraid, perhaps. Or ashamed, or forgetful. Or perhaps he had no wish to remember. Anna tell you all this? Did she come here after it happened? Nay, not Anna. It was the omens told me. Great. So I can be sure it's true. The omens need not your faith to be true. It is you who needs the omens to lead you to truth. Did the Baron have anything to do with his wife's miscarriage? Foul-tempered he is, and he's a fondness for hooch. No doubt makes his temper even fouler. Did he abuse his family? <laughs> he must have noticed something. The Pella's old, near blind. But Princess came and licked her hand. So what? She's a wise beast. Only comes to those who suffer. What happened to the child? In a grave thrown. Without rite or ceremony, it awoke. Now it wanders. It seeks vengeance. A botchling. White wolf. Wise wolf. Catch the botchling. The botchling will help. Lead the wolf to the loved ones. Botchlings suck the blood of pregnant women and eat their fetuses. They don't help. It is a being cursed, and witches lift curses. If the white wolf can't lift it, he should bring me its blood. Blood will always find kindred blood. Heard of one witcher who lifted a botchling's curse. Never tried it myself, though. I know you need to bury it under the threshold. And give it a name. Perform the I'm Roin. The ritual of naming. That's an elven custom. Human, elven, dwarven, ancient. Spirits have no race. They honor not its meaning. Win a spirit's favor, and the spirit shall aid you. Ask, and it will answer. Seek, and it will show you the way. Why do you want its blood? Blood, blood, blood. It binds men for all ages, the living and the dead. Sure, but what do you want to do with it? At times, a century is too short for two brothers to reconcile. One dies before things are set right. The other then brings his blood to the Pella. Mm -hmm. And what does the Pella do? He awaits forefathers' eve. He mixes the blood with milk, herbs, and hen's feet. He drinks to reconcile the dead with the living. There shall be no forefathers' eve this year. But we'll find a way all the same. I hear you right. You mentioned Forefather's Eve. Pretty old custom. Thought it had died out. Death lurks in every bog and puddle round here. Folk know they could die, their earthly matters unresolved. Then they require help, or they'll not know peace. Forefather's Eve must be performed. Light the tallow candles to lead them through the dark. Call them by name. Appease their regrets. Only then may they depart in peace. Whatever I do, I gotta find the botchling first. Seek it at midnight, near the grave that lies empty. If what you say is true, the Baron ought to know where that grave is. Ok. Euh, donc, avant, on peut lui parler. Euh, on va lui parler un petit peu. Folk from the village come here often. Oh, when help they need, the Pella they seek. Help with what? With the dead that come a haunting. Peace must be made, but they must then wait for Forefather's Eve, or when an evil spirit runs wild in a homestead, drive the spirit off the Pelican. And if I needed, say, a love potion, then to the witch you would be sent. Not a matter for the Pella, that. 
could use it. Alors, qu'as-tu d'intéressant à me donner euh, Il n'a rien d'intéressant, ok. Hmm. Ça, c'est une hache niveau 18. Oh, oh, oh qu'est-ce qu'elle va faire mal Il euh, n'y a rien d'autre. En fait, ce que je voulais faire avec lui, c'était... Euh... J'essaie de voir si c'est possible. Et que, et euh, en quête secondaire, je devais faire euh, Gwint les joueurs de Velen. Euh, Passe au chaman, mais le chaman c'est lui, non Ah non, c'est pas lui le chaman. Le chaman c'est lequel Ah, c'est celui-là Ah ouais, d'accord Mais c'est pas du tout la même quête. D'accord, bah je ferai ça la prochaine fois. Donc, lisons le. Regardons plutôt le glossaire. Concernant les couvains, donc les créatures maudites. Hmm. Ok. Euh, donc on va les téléporter. On va trouver un point très proche pour aller se téléporter. Moi j'ai quelques petits lags quand je filme, c'est bizarre. Quand je filme pas, je lis pas de lag. C'est sûrement parce que ça prend un peu de ressources. Mais c'est pas grave, on va faire avec. Vous, vous ne verrez pas la différence. Normalement, il devrait pas avoir de lag. Et s'il y a des lags, je, je m'en excuse vraiment. Donc on va voir le baron qui, lui, normalement, sait où est enterré le couvain. Qui était enterré le, où était le, enterré le couvain. Oh que s'est-il passé On dirait que j'ai bien fait de, de prendre la carte unique du baron. Pour le Gwint. Mmh. Allons voir ce qui se passe. Merci, j'ai vu qu'il y avait du feu. On va équiper l'arbalète. Donc oui, en même temps, en parlant de à cette armure là, j'ai reçu une quête euh, qui me dit d'aller sur euh, l'archipel de Skellig. Ouais, on n'a pas encore le niveau, donc euh, on la fera plus tard. What? Fire. You blind? Nobody willing to put it out? Ain't that simple. Most are afraid. Baron flies into a rage. He takes no prisoners. My brother's in the stable. We've got to save him. He'll burn alive. Him and the horses. See what I can do. Hurry now, quick! C'est verrouillé. Hum, par en haut, peut-être. J'ai chaud jusqu'ici. On va sauvegarder. Don't play me for a fool. 
You'd been beating them for years. Finally, they'd had enough and fled. Sound about right? We need to talk. Sit down. You beat them. I never laid a finger on Tamara. Not once. And on Anna. That's another story. She always knew how to spark my ire. Expect me to believe you were a loving father to Tamara after that scene in the courtyard? You're free to believe whatever you wish. But she was always the apple of my eye. She had the run of the place, ask anyone. She'd ride the horses, hunt with the men, at times join them on their rounds. And they'd send for her when I flew into a rage, for only she could calm me. Make it sound like she led a charmed life. If that's the case, why'd she run? I'd hardly need you if I knew. How'd she make you angry? Too much salt in the soup? Socks never darned? Twenty years we've known each other. She's seen me drunk and sober. She was there to greet me when I returned the victor. She was there to patch me up in defeat. Like no other, she knew where to press, where to pinch, so it would hurt. You beat her? For that? For criticizing you? Ah, oh, Witcher, you haven't a clue, have you? Well, perhaps I shall tell you about it one day. One day, but not today. You knew they had run away from the start? Yes, I knew. Why didn't you tell me? Wasted my time. Say I had. Say I'd said I had troubles. Couldn't control my wife, my daughter. What kind of flaccid prick would you take me for? Doesn't much matter now. I know how to find them. How? I know about the baby. Anna and I. It wasn't as it seemed. Seems. All right, I'm all ears. Tell me what happened, the truth this time. I'd been soaking myself three days straight. Anna came to me, said they were leaving. I begged them to stay. She refused to hear it. I tried to stop her. She wriggled like an eel. We struggled. She fell. Last blasted thing I remember. Woke up in the morn, breeches heavy with my own piss. A large bump on my head. Sadly, they were gone. Know what that's like, Witcher? No. How the fuck could you? I was left with nothing. Nothing! Only the bottle. Tomorrow present for all this, she see you quarrel. Through the doorway, perhaps. She didn't enter the room. Shame, too. Things might have turned out differently. The sight of her always calmed me. Signs of a fight in the room. Hole in the wall, wine all over the landing. Was that you? Aye. We tussled. 
She tried to whack me on the noggin with a candlestick, but kept missing. Hit the wall and the pillar instead. I staggered backwards onto the table, spilled the wine, slipped and tumbled. Anna used that moment to flee. She rushed down the stairs, still clutching that damn candlestick. I caught her on the landing. We fell. I, I thought I had her. Then she turned and smacked me in the head. I blacked out. Don't know what happened next. When I came to, I was alone. What happened next? Next. It only got worse. I awoke at sunset, not knowing how many days had passed. Thought it was all a plowing, drunken nightmare. And then I went to the bedchamber, and Anna was not there. Instead, there was blood everywhere. I knew she'd miscarried. My breath short, my throat locked. I neared the bed. And saw it. It lay there, a tiny thing, defenseless, on bloodied sheets, dead. And it was my doing. Maybe your doing, maybe not. But that amulet she wore could be important, or maybe the fact that she lost it. What did you do with the child? What was I to do? Took it out and buried it. Just like that? Damn you! I gave no thought to a funeral. It was a horror. I wanted it to end. That child had been my dream. I told Anna, the little one, our little one, to make things right. Yet she died before she could be born. Understand, Witcher. My child was dead. Get hold of yourself. Men like you, when they break down, look downright pathetic. You're a heartless bastard. <laughs> Mutations worked then. But here's the good news. Your dead child might help us find the one who's still alive. And your wife. What? How? Sometimes miscarried fetuses, if they don't get a proper burial, turn into botchlings. Into... fucking... what? A cursed creature that draws strength from killing pregnant women. Once it's strong enough, it attacks those who scorned it. But how... how does it know? Blood ties. They're a strong bond. A bond I want to use to find your family. How? One of two ways. Legends claim you can bury a botchling under the family's threshold, perform a ritual, and turn it into a lubberkin. That's a sort of, uh, hob, a guardian spirit that could lead me to your family. And the other way? We kill it and draw some blood. Take that to the Peller and he does the rest. Do not kill my child. It's suffered enough already. Lift the curse that it may finally rest in peace. Whatever we do, we gotta find the botchling first. I'll show you where I buried her, and I'll dig the grave at my threshold. If it turns out we can't transform the botchling into a lubberkin, they can bury us in it. Handy either way. The sooner we resolve this, the better. Best do it tonight, at midnight. Then wait here with me. Near midnight, I'll take you to where I buried her. Get word to the common folk. Ought to stay in their homes tonight and draw a line of salt outside their doors. And try to sober up. Do I take a shovel to dig up the grave? Take it. You'll need it, but not for that. A bit further, follow me.
Et bien, nous allons nous arrêter là pour cette vidéo. J'espère que celle-ci vous aura plu. N'hésitez pas à laisser un commentaire et un j'aime. Et surtout, vous abonner à la chaîne. C'était Zostel. Pour chaque type à l'acheter, passez une bonne journée, une bonne soirée et vive les jeux vidéo.